Hey, how are you? Today I wanted to talk about something that's very close to my heart. It's about showing up, being seen no matter what age, 40, 50, 60, and selling your work online, selling your art. Yes, you heard that correctly. This is a journey that can be both exhilarating and nerve wracking, but trust me, it's absolutely worth it. If you've ever felt that nagging fear of putting yourself out there or wondered if you have what it takes to make a living from your art, you are not alone. But here's the good news. There is a world out there waiting to see your art and celebrate it. Yes, you heard that right. Celebrate it. So let's dive in. I think that we've all heard the word, the term starving artist, uh, that old myth that artists have to struggle, that our work is a passion project, not something that can truly support us financially. It's an idea that's been around for centuries. And let's be honest, it is pretty outdated. But despite knowing this in our minds in an intel on an intellectual level many of us still carry that fear deep down we worry that if we put ourselves out there no one will value our, our work or worse we'll be rejected and i know this feeling all too well believe me there was a time when i hesitated to share my art online even after going to art college for many years i felt like i wasn't good enough i even struggled to call myself an artist for many years I also felt that my work wasn't what people were looking for. It wasn't the mainstream. But then I realized something crucial after doing quite a lot of work on this. I realized that this fear wasn't about my art. It was about my mindset. Now, mindset is everything. It's the foundation of how you show up in the world in every area of your life. And if you believe that you're destined to struggle, if you believe in the starving artist myth, then that belief will shape your actions or lack thereof. But what if you shifted that mindset? What if instead of thinking I'm just an artist or the whole starving artist thing is true, what if you started thinking I'm a thriving artist and the world is eager to see what I create? The big what if. Getting over the fear of being seen is about embracing this new mindset. It's about understanding that your art has value, that it deserves to be seen and that there are people out there who are waiting, yes, waiting to discover what you have to offer. But for that to happen, you need to step out of your comfort zone and show up. Now, let's talk about the practical side of showing up online. This is where many artists get stuck because it requires stepping into unfamiliar territory. Think of it this way. The Internet has made it easier than ever to connect with art lovers from around the globe. So you might be thinking on the micro level in terms of where you live, but there's a huge global platform out there. Platforms like Instagram, Etsy, your own website can even serve as a personal gallery. YouTube. Um, you don't need to rely on physical galleries or art fairs alone anymore. And you have the power to reach a global audience right at your fingertips. But here's the thing, it might not come naturally at first. Selling your art online is like learning a new skill. It takes practice and you might feel awkward posting at first um, and uncertain how to market yourself. I have spent many years trying this and trying to hone that and seeing what works and what doesn't work. And that's completely normal. What matters is that you show up consistently, share your work, talk about your pro process and let people get to know you as an artist. People love knowing more about you and why you do what you do and where you get your inspiration from. These are all just ways to tell your story and invite people in to more of your, what you create. Remember, people don't just buy art, they buy the story behind the art. They buy into your journey, your passion, your creativity. And you might feel like, well, I'm too old to do that or the market is saturated, but that is just not true. People want to buy from you because they want to know more about you and they like you. And that is no matter what age you, you are, because you'll find that other people want to buy your work regardless of what age you are, it is not a limit for you. 
Here's a little exercise for you. Next time you're about to post your art online and feel that wave of doubt, just take a deep breath and ask yourself, what's the worst that could happen? Maybe someone won't like it. That's okay. Art is subjective and not everyone will resonate with your work. But for every person who doesn't connect, there are many who will. And those are the people that matter. Those are your people, your community, your tribe. You might be surprised at the positive response you receive once you do start showing up. People are drawn to authenticity and when you start to share your art with confidence, it shines through. If you believe in the value of your work, others will too. I remember when I first started posting my work online, I was scared, yes, but I was also amazed by the support and encouragement from people I didn't even know. It was a turning point that made me realize I was standing in my own way all along. It was my mindset that needed to shift and it was my mindset that was holding me back. That big, what if it actually turns out better than I expected? So how do you start? Simple, start small, but start today. Post one piece of your art, share a little bit of the scenes, behind the scenes shot of your studio maybe, write about what inspired your latest piece, use hashtags to connect with others in the art community. Little by little, you'll build your presence online. You'll get more comfortable with the process. And more importantly, you'll start to see that the starving artist mentality is just that, it's a mentality. It's not a reality you have to accept. The reality is there's a world out there waiting to see your art, to connect with it and to celebrate it. But you have to give them the chance. If you don't get visual and make yourself visible, nobody will see you. So don't let fear stop you. Your art deserves to be seen as much as the other artist. You deserve to thrive as an artist as much as another artist. And there is room at the table for everybody. There is a whole world out there. So go out there, show up and let the world see what you've got. If you like this video, thank you so much for watching. I hope you found it helpful. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more content like this. And let me know in the comments, what's your biggest fear when it comes to sharing your art online and how are you planning to overcome it? Remember, you're not alone on this journey and I'm here to help. Happy creating and I'll see you in the next video.